We finally have a new house announcement. After months of the Halloween Horror Nights team being very cryptic and teasing us, we finally know what another house will be. The Last of Us has been officially announced as one of the houses at Halloween Horror Nights. The Last of Us is coming to Universal Studios Florida and Universal Studios Hollywood. Many had already speculated that a Last of Us house would be coming to this year's event. Here is what the announcement says. You and your squad will encounter the haunting and overgrown world of Naughty Dog's video game in a brand new terrifying way as you make your way through an abandoned Pittsburgh. Join Joel and Ellie and don't make a sound if you want to survive clickers, hunters, and more. No matter what, keep finding something to fight for. Guys, I'm telling you, it's real. Why are you so obsessed with this universal legend? <laughs> you think I'd be used to them by now. Thanks for paying attention, Jordy. Sorry. All right, just skip to exactly 32 seconds in the video Jeez, and I- another conspiracy theory? There's no the park. Hey, are you guys seeing this? The announcement came with this promo video, so let's break it down. As you can see, they have placed a mature game rating at the bottom of the screen, plus the PlayStation logo to let us know that this house will be based off of the game and not the TV series. The video also shows a few references to mushrooms with the picture on the wall in the background and on the phone to refer to the fungus of the clickers. In the video, we are introduced to three new characters for this year's Halloween Horror Nights, Jordan, Sophia, and Drew. Much like how they announced houses last year with the Scream Squad, we saw them in multiple promotion videos, so we could see Sophia and Drew in future house announcements. Guys, I'm telling you, it's real. Why are you so obsessed with this Universal Legend? You can hear the dialogue about Universal Legends. We have seen the Halloween Horror Nights team refer to Legends in other posts, like this one where they say bad things happen to those that go alone. Then Drew mentions to skip to 32 seconds, which refers to this year's event, Halloween Horror Nights 32, and then at the 32 second mark it shows this cryptic message, which when translated it says, never go alone the same tagline they used last year and now are continuing with this year. I thought maybe See in the Fog would be the tagline for this year's event since they did sell a bunch of merchandise with that theme. I don't know if it will still be used along with the Never Go Alone theme, but we will see. The video also shows a poster in the background giving us another Easter egg which refers to The Last of Us with the word Contagious. This should be a very exciting house and very scary. So now we know two of the houses coming to Halloween Horror Nights. Chucky was the first announcement all the way back at the end of Halloween Horror Nights last year. Universal Studios Florida will have 10 houses and Universal Studios Hollywood will have 8 houses. With the announcement of The Last of Us coming to Halloween Horror Nights, Universal Studios Hollywood released ticket information with some new tickets for the event. You can now get an early access ticket for HHN. This will allow you to experience select haunted houses at 5.30 p.m., which gets you in an hour and a half early. This could be similar to the Stay and Scream ticket at Universal Studios Florida. Frequent Fear Pass is also available now. This lets you experience multiple nights of the event, up to 30 for the Frequent Fear and up to 38 for the Ultimate Fear Pass with no blockout dates. The Frequent Fear Pass does have some blockout dates, unlike the Ultimate Fear Pass. Another new ticket for this event is the Halloween Horror Nights Hotel and Ticket Package. This includes a one-day general admission ticket and a ticket to HHN plus a stay at one of the Universal Partner Hotels. The feature hotels are the Garland and the Sheraton. The Sheraton is within walking distance to Universal Studios Hollywood. So that's it for the announcements so far for Halloween Horror Nights. What houses do you think will be announced next? Stay tuned for more announcements, and if you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe to see more content about the Universal theme parks.